Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is going to be the full video on my 2004 Binaire 2 Cool 16 inch oscillating pedestal fan. So, yeah, this is a video where I show you all around the fan. So, here, of course, we have the front of the fan. I tried to grab it from right here and then that bit just came off. So I had to put it back on again. Oops, I'm not a bit more. Hopefully you can see that. Here's the side then. And here we have the back. Hopefully you can see that. Let me just check. Yep. So here's the back of the fan. As you can tell, this is literally totally different to on my other binary when I've got a double blade. Yeah, it has a totally different back design. On the back, it has the oscillation like usual. It also has the um, switch for the speeds. You have off on there as well, which is zero. And then it goes from off to, to high, medium and low. It goes off, high, medium and low. Or off, three, two, one. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, the information stickers on the side of the motor housing, it was underneath it, like on a Holmes one with the swirl base, but I moved it to make it easier for me to show you guys. So yeah, now I'm gonna show you back around the, to the side again where the motor housing is. And I'll zoom in. Oh, it's already zoomed in. I don't think you're gonna be able to see it, so I'm just gonna read it for you. This is a model BASF1016. It's got the Binaire logo at the top. It's 220, that's 240 volts, 50 hazards made in China. And the watts is actually 90 slash 100. So it's either 90 watts or 100 watts. So yes. So now I'm just going to zoom out on the camera. So it's either 90 watts or 100, it says 90 and it's, a, and it's got like a slash and it's got 100 next to it. So now I'm going to turn around the fan, I'll start it up for you after. This is quite a powerful fan guys, but it is very noisy. It goes so much out So let's see if you can see it. Yep, yeah. okay, so I'm going to start it off on low with that oscillation then. See what I mean guys, this is only low, but I can still feel it from here, it's not just like a gentle breeze, it's quite a strong breeze, I can still feel from here, this is such a powerful fan, yeah like I said it's even more powerful than the other bind I've got, I thought that was powerful, but this is even more powerful. really is a powerful fan. I'll let it scale to 4 minutes. I actually will probably use this fan in the summer. I'll probably use it maybe at the side it is at now. Maybe the other side where I'm standing, I'll use the other binder that I've got. So I've got two fans for then. So yeah, here's medium then. Which is quite a jump. I can feel so much air coming from it now and it's very loud. The fan's very loud but it moves so much air guys. It is really a good fan. I'll let this get to five minutes and I'll do high. Alright, so here's high then. Yep, 
Yeah, well, let's get to six minutes and I'll do a load of oscillation on. Moves so much air and it's well loud, I literally have to shout so you guys might be able to hear me. That's how loud this fan is, but it blows so much air. Here is low with oscillation on. Yeah, that's low oscillation. I could talk a little bit quieter now because the fan gets quieter on low. I noticed on low it's quiet, medium it's about average, then high it's really loud. Yeah, let's get to seven minutes and I'll do medium with oscillation on then high with oscillation on after a minute of medium. So roughly it should be about the same amount of time as the one where me showing you the fan but not like around it. Me just running it for you. Yeah, just like the homes one it has a type of oscillation where it doesn't oscillate very far. You know, the home is one of the swirl base at Sol in America. So yeah, anyway, here's medium with oscillation. And I absolutely love this fan, guys. It's so cool. Alright, so here is the final speed, which is high with oscillation on. Such a good fan, I'm, I highly recommend getting one of these if you can find one. Alright, so I'm going to start right now and do off and spin down. Alright, so here's off and spin down then. Just move quickly so you can see it without me getting in the way. Bearings seem pretty good on the fan. Yeah, the bearings on it. It seems pretty good because it's got a decent spin down time. I think the old, I think the other bar now got got a better spin down time. But overall, you may be wondering why did I end up getting one of these fans when I've already got a bar now one. Well, it's because this fan is my childhood fan, and this is the actual model I've wanted. The bar now one I've got's okay. But it wasn't the particular model I was looking for. This is the exact model I was looking for. Yeah, so that's going to be it for this full video. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. As always, I will see you in the next video. And bye for now, guys.